Hi, and welcome to Where's the Action? I'm your host, Ross Benjamin. I will be previewing Saturday's Big 12 College Football Contest between the 17th ranked Oklahoma State Cowboys as they host the TCU Horned Frogs. Kickoff comes at noon Eastern Time, and currently, as we speak, Oklahoma State is a seven-point home favorite. Well, TCU is off to a relatively disappointing 3-3 three three start, and they're coming off a mediocre, by their standards, 7-6 and six campaign a season ago. If you consider the fact that this is a program that went a combined 47-5 and five from 2008 through 2011 under current head coach Gary Patterson, you can understand why the, why the natives are getting a bit restless in Fort Worth. TCU does come off a win, but it was an unimpressive one as they won 27-17 at home versus Kansas and didn't come close to covering the 24-point favorite line at home. In addition, the TCU offense has been absolutely anemic this season as they are 110th nationally in total offense. Contrarily, their defense has been absolutely super all season long, and last week they held Kansas to 198 yards of total offense, and they're ranked 16th nationally in total defense in the country. Oklahoma State came off a disappointing and humiliating and devastating loss at West Virginia a few weeks ago, 30-21, to which was their first loss of the season, and it came as a 19-point road favorite in Morgantown. They were able to bounce back two weeks ago in their previous game versus Kansas State, 33-29, but that win didn't come without some anxious moments, folks. As a matter of fact, Kansas State held a 29-23 fourth quarter lead in that game, and Oklahoma State had to score a touchdown and had an insurance field goal in the last four minutes for the final margin of victory. Now, Oklahoma State, in, despite that non-cover versus Kansas State two weeks ago as a 12.5-point favorite, has gone a terrific 12-2 ATS in their last 14 games as a home favorite. They won all 14 of those games outright by an average of a whopping 32 points per game. As a matter of fact, the only two non-covers in that whole sequence has come versus Kansas State. So you can make the case that they're, they've been unbeatable the last few years as a home favorite versus any team that's not named Kansas State. Oklahoma State's def defense has played pretty good this year, but they've been vulnerable versus the pass, and their offense, as usual, continues to put up a lot of yards and score a lot of points. A very high octane offense under head coach Mike Gundy. Now, for my final analysis on this game, as far as coming up with a selection, I have the smallest of leans with Oklahoma State minus seven here in this spot over TCU. Simple matter is, when you play at Stillwater, you need the offensive firepower to keep up with the high-octane offense of Oklahoma State. Yes, TCU's defense is very good, but their offense has been terrible. And, it's, and I see what's happening here is TCU's defense will eventually wear down late in the game. And as just a one-touchdown home favorite in this spot, I like Oklahoma State to come up with a statement game here to improve the 5-1 and one and win decisively. Oklahoma State, minus 7, over TCU as my free selection in college football on Saturday. You've been watching Where's the Action? I'm your host, Ross Benjamin. Thank you for joining me. I'd like to wish each and every one of you all the best in the upcoming week.